Oh, thank you guys for the re song request. These are, I'm looking forward to all of these. Nice requests, everybody. Hey, Steo. Yeah, I'm trying, to, I'm trying to spread the word about Tag Pro. I feel like uh, very underrated. It's just capture the flag with like controls, but then you get people that are like really into the controls and they, um, they like, <laughs> it's hard to explain, but like there's so much strat, it's four balls against four balls, capture the flag. And when you see people that are good at the game, like really good, man, man, it's art. <laughs> it's art, I'm telling you, I'm telling you. Like I, I get stoked when I watch really good tag pro players. <laughs> it's very silly. Three, two, one, three, three, two, one. Oh, anti-block, anti-block. Two, 
And I'm gonna tell you, the cupcakes are coming out of the oven and they are piping hot. I don't know what that was, but everybody drink for him. <laughs> <laughs> everyone, everyone oh. just said. The following is a production of National League Tag Pro and cannot be reproduced in whole or in part without the express written permission of National League Tag Pro and its media partners. Thank you. It's 10 p.m. Tuesday night. It can only mean one thing. So grab someone you love and hold each other real, real close. We're about to put on a show. Sit back, relax, and enjoy Tag Pro After Dark. Hi, my name is Yelpa. That's proper reason I hear it's week four MLTP. I don't even know if these are the right standings. I think these are the right standings. You got Toronto Captors, you got Snipe on eighth place versus tenth place. I am working on shit in the back end. Please do not rush me right now. Snipe on has Dog Stomper, Aaron, Nameless, and Peanut. Lots of trades, lots of movement from last week. No Crab Rave, though. No Crab Rave. Toronto Captors, we got Agency New Man, G Man 8181, and Yawn. These teams look very familiar to each other. Here is a video as I finish things on the back end. All right, I think everything is done on the back end. So let's get this going. Stream is R if the teams are ready. If the teams are ready, they're being a little weird right now. I don't really appreciate it, but you know what? Fuck it. It's time for some tag pro. Don't you don't you agree? Don't you agree? They haven't launched, by the way. I don't think they agree. Maybe they will agree in a moment. Oh, okay, so they're, 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 I haven't been able to update this, this, the thing yet, Nameless. Been a little busy. I just got the notice to stream this game, like, literally at 10.01. Literally at 10.01. So, you know, whatever. Okay. Now that I'm ready... They don't seem to be ready. I'm ready. I'm so ready. I'm ready to dance. And I hope you are too. Welcome to Tag for After Dark, kids. Maybe we'll get this started momentarily. Maybe not. We'll find out. We'll find out. Looks like we're looking for a game right now. Hey, Robinie. Good morning. Ohio design must. All right, group's broken. Bruce broken, okay. I don't even remember who's on these teams. I think it's the exact opposite of the teams that they draft. I don't remember. Dodds Falls not here. Whoa. Okay. Okay. Dodds Falls not here. That I can tell you. 
This is a Dad's Fall free production. And it looks like we've about ready. We've we've launched, but I'm not ready. I'm not ready. After all. So I'm gonna refresh one more time and hope for the best. Because it's time for game one half one on Willow. Ah. Uh, almost. Yeah, they look so different. Let me see if I can get all the changes made. And we've gone back to group. You're not even supposed to see this page. What's going on? What's going on? We've gone back to group. I don't know. Let's just dance with... Take two! Sound. Speed. Action. And we are underway, and these teams look oh so different. Uh, see if I can get through all the changes here. Nameless was on the Pella Caps, dropped by the Pella Caps, picked up by Toronto Captors, traded. Was he traded or was he dropped? It may have been traded for Yawn by uh, Snipe Hunt. Aaron was picked up in a trade for BDL from another team. Pink Prisoner is known as Dog Stomper and Little M LTP. This is cynical. He likes to farm returns like it's going out of style. And coming back in style. It's smoother than a raccoon's. Uterus. Okay, I just went there. Yeah. And Peanut Peanut was dropped week one by the Knights Who Say Re. And he's get he's back in the country from Columbia and he's getting his major sh opportunity again right here, right now. Meanwhile, his Pink Prisoner might have a chance to get out of here. No, no name is there. Was no name on this team to begin with? We have a honker. Let's see, the first Toronto Captors Agency and No Name are the veterans on this team. They've been there all season. Why would you trade Agency? He's 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 very good. Uh G-Man. Ooh, G-Man started on Snipe Hunt, I believe. And was picked up. No. G-Man didn't start to snipe on. G-Man started on a different team as Aaron gets us on the board. 1-0-2. Snipe hunt. G-Man was on another team. Last pick of the draft. Mr. Irrelevant dropped. And then... Later... Picked up by this Toronto Captors team. Yawn was, again, part of that trade with Nameless. Similar teams, similar backgrounds, similar everything. Snipe Hunt does not have a single one of their original players. Not on one. These are four balls that did not draft. But they do have a one cap lead. Yeah. Now that bottom pump's got to be a tag from Peanut causes an allergy. The, these Toronto captors may want to stay out of the five guys because Peanut is munching away. And it's just a matter of keeping space and using negative space to their advantage right now. And Aaron has stayed alive for the entire of that tag pro, but no one was really chasing No Name and No Name's got had space and time. Now no name's gone. Nameless with the pull. G-Man the other way. Uh, 
And we got a 2v2 the other way. G-Man. Oh, it's 3v3 now. Ah, oh, and the lane's there. Stopping on a dime is G-Man 8181. And we're tied at one. Tag Pro here to G-Man. He's going to go and lead no name here. Can't really do it. It's kind of a dead period right now. I'm just... Forgive me if I'm not the most talkative right now. I was watching... I was literally... Watching my minors team scrim when I got a message at 10 1 p.m. Eastern Time saying, Hey, this majors game needs a streamer and it starts right now. I wish I could tell you what I had to do to get this stream ready. But you know what? That's not important. We're here now. Bit of a holding pattern right now. It's good to see Peanut back, though. Love that guy. Spent a couple of weeks overseas. Drop by the you said re for that reason. Bring Barton Sadness, who's looking like a snack and a half at the at the majors level. 2v1 now for Aaron as Pops come up dueling JJ's nameless is gonna get one instead of dealing with the on rushing Toronto captors here. Aaron doesn't really have a lane, no name crashes in the nick of time. Like Super 5 Navbatia crashes the Scotiabank Center anytime the Raptors are allowed to have fans, which is not right now. No fans at Raptors games. Peanut now on the continuation. Agency couldn't get that snipe off in time. Ooh, flaccid grab. Lane is there. Peanut, you gotta finish. Peanut doesn't finish. Agency has bought the farm, and it's 2-1 to the Toronto Captors. Y'all going nowhere fast. Peanut tries to turn the corner. There is a possibility of a cap here. If the blocks can get their agency, sheds Aaron aside. Gets out of his own. Looking to kiss. No hesitation. And here comes Aaron with the counter cap to make it 2 2. Tie game, folks. Oof. Not what you want from your support over there from G Man as we come up now to our penultimate pups of Game One Half One. And it's a double tag pros to snipe hunt, but can green team cap when they change their entire team? Well, when you move like that and you groove like that, it's going to be clinical. And that was clinical. So clinical, in fact, it's a double blind study. Three to two in favor of Snipe Hunt. Sometimes it helps be a basic bitch, and it helps right there. 
easy angles, easy uh, lanes, pretty cap. Oh my. Uh, uh, I thought Aaron was going to go for the bomb there, couldn't do it. Yawn gets a pull. That's an easy cap for Yawn. Coming the other way. 3-3. 31 seconds left to go in this half. 3-3 is still our score. It's been a cagey one. I feel like these teams know each other. Well, of course they know each other better than any other team. Well, that's not fair. Toronto Captors know Snipe Hunt better than Snipe Hunt holds Snipe Hunt. This team's only been together a couple of days. We don't know what's going on there. Three to three is our score. Ending the first half of action. I'm not even going to read stats. Yeah, 3-3 three, three is our score right now. And... For all you cats and kittens out there in Twitchland, Konbanwa. As they say in Tokyo, good evening. My name is Yalba. Beep boop. And you are here for Tag Pro after dark and it's a good one it's after dark we have two teams fighting for points this season two teams with a lot of history with each other two teams which have dominated the headlines of the mltp community recently and well what else is there to say about it than that to all, when, 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 two, two passing stars have history with each other, well, sparks will fly. Gravity will bring them closer together, and we will see some fireworks. And, folks, I have a feeling we're in some, some fireworks tonight, whether it's the dramatic behind the scenes fireworks or the one you lead right up front. And with that said, it's time for game one. Half two on Willow two. Let's go. G-Man gets a grab here, not going much of anywhere. Peanut and Aaron are looking for a way to coexist, to work together. To generate a capping opportunity. Aaron, the bomb, friendly fire exercise. We're kind of sort of reset, but yes, we are. we are. First round of puffs in the books. RB to Aaron and JJ to Yawn. Aaron's going to try and bomb past everyone but Yawn. <sighs> Yawn is there. Yes, he is. Uh, 
Uh, G-Man and Nameless are fighting over that bomb. Tends to go nowhere, but G-Man's got space if he wants to make a grab. Good discipline there from G-Man. Aaron, however, out through bottom. Nowhere to go. So that's the second round of Pups. Bottom Pups is JJ. Top Pups is RB. It's going to be a Pups sweep for the Toronto Captors. But what do the Captors know about sweeps? I thought they liked to win best in best of sevens. Or in six if Clay Thompson tears his ACL. G-Man. Bombs. Get some space. Separation. Nameless is there. As always. Yawns, RB is out. Nameless is on plane. Man D. Ping prisoner. Dog stamper. Whatever you want to call cynical. Makes the tag. As he is known to do. Cynical, surprisingly. Ping prisoner, I should say. Surprisingly, not drafted by MLTP. Not bid on an NLTP. But he's getting that opportunity now because... In the end, the cream always, always rises to the top. The bread will bake. The soil will heal. And in no games case, the cap comes in. And it's four to three. Toronto captors over Snipe Hunt. They got a chance here, 2v1 opportunity. G-Man taken out by Peanut. It's a... F we got a seven balls in base right now. Kind of, sort of, but not really. No name's looking for a way to go. He's going to try and boost between those spikes and top, and the top island. Or just boost into the gate, because sometimes you just got to get right in there. Head first. RB, another pup sweep to the Toronto Captors. RB to G Man 8181 of the type of the agency. That RB is gone. Peanut's got to grab. Soul situation with Yawn. I think Peanut can handle it. Agencies. Taking care of the Hunters. Like an enraged elephant. And it is 5 to 3. Toronto Captors. A few honks later. No name with the handy. That top has a tap, you know, I can tell. Everyone's there. And it's yet another pup sweep for the Toronto Captors. And it's another RB typo combination. And G Man's got the RB. Agency's got the typo. And I've seen this movie before. I can tell you how it ends. But don't you want to find out for yourselves? Six to three, Toronto. And they've entered this second half like the 2014 Argonauts. Defensive stalwarts. And Snipe Hunt's got to get something going. Get something moving. Yawn takes out the offender. No name. Stays alive a little bit. Tries to hand off the yawn. Yawn shows some great discipline. Another pup sweep. Another pup sweep for the Toronto Captors. An agency's got another tag pro. This time G-Man's got a JJ. Pink Prisoner can't take out G-Man with the snipe. A return for cap opportunity. From G-Man. Assisted by agency. I've seen this before. And 
sniper has got to get something doing. And Aaron is going to try to be the one to try to do it. Yawn. Takes the backwoods. Gets the stop. So we come up now to our anti-penultimate pups of game one. The pups before the pups before the final round of pups. Guess what? It's not a pup sweep. It's a pup split. No name and dog stomper ping prisoner. Each have tag pros and they're each leading. Yawn. Aaron, excuse me, goes cross court with the snipe. Peanut trying to bring one back. There's a tag pro to beat. Ooh, get out of the way. Let ping prisoner save the day. Kissing the tag pros there is a cap. But instead, it all ends in a kiss. And yes, I've had many a good night ending the kiss, but not necessarily in a tag pro game. And no name, trying to put it in the dagger here with 213 left to go. Ooh, smooth moves, no name. But can you finish it off? He cannot, as we come up now to our penultimate pups of regulation. Watch you by AVN. You know what? I'm not even going to make that joke. Just gets, keep going here. Split tag pros. Peanut needs a kiss. Or enough of the distraction. It comes. And Snipe Hunt gets on the board. But with 120 left to go, Snipe Hunt's going to do something monumental to try and get points out of this one, or else Toronto Captors are going to end up with three big ones. Fifty-five seconds left to go. Final pups. They're both RBs. And they're split. But again, it's how you're using them that matters. And no name goes on Reed Fed RB. And he's just going to sit there and buy time because that's the thing to do. Gets the grab. All free grab. It's just bombing to bomb to get separation from Peanut. Does so. It's past three somehow. Kills the other team. That's the dagger. No Name puts a cherry on top of this Sunday and beats his former teammate, No Name, and Snipe Hunt, even though Peanut brings one back to make it 8 to 5. No Name looking for another? 10 seconds left to go. I think he'll just be very, very content to run out the clock here. And that's going to do it. 8 to 5 is your score agency 26 tags g-man three caps and a whole lot of power-ups three points to, to the toronto captors <laughs>
teams are taking a minute right now to, to come together just for a quick moment and say hello. And it looks like we're ready for game two, half one. Which will be... Whoa. On OTI. Jardim. Now, on offense here for Snipe Hunt, looking to make a name for himself in the majors level, trying to get some points back here for Snipe Hunt. 3v3 in base, looking for the back wall. Can't find the edge. No name grabs and heads nowhere to handy the yawn. The poost only sends him so far. Don't we all hate it, folks, when that poos doesn't send you exactly where you need to be? First round of pup swap, it's double RBs. And Snipe Hunt wins them both. It's a sweep. And Peanut gets the fuse out past three. He's got the lane. And Peanut brings one in for the Snipe Hunt, giving them the early lead. And it's going to be 2-0. Just like that from Aaron. Peanut can't make it three because we're kind of sort of reset now. And teams are going to have to build up all over again. But really, isn't the best part of Tag Pro the build up? Those moments where you have to work your way in. Relax. Moisturize. Tenderize and prepare yourself for that chance to score. It's my favorite part, anyway. No name going in deep, but gets met with a tag. G Man can't get out of base, and the chance here for Peanut to do just that. But no name's got to block him at the end. No siree, but Aaron now looking for a path to victory. And we got six in base here. And that's another reset. And we're going to have to start this all over again. And no name wastes no time. But can't do it. <sighs> yeah. It's comes up now for power ups, but they're but these power ups, they're not your enemies. They're your helpers. They're your friends. Use them to your advantage, as Ping Prisoner's trying to do, but kind of gets in the way. You've got to coordinate with your power ups. You got to communicate your needs. Just like right there, both players. Look for the kiss and went and got it. G-Man almost caps off it, but Peanut gets the pull. And he's coming out. Past two and a half. He's going to take a lap, though. Because Agency's right there. G-Man tries to find a lane, and he does. And G-Man stuffs it in there to make it two to one for the Toronto Captors.
534 left to go to the half. Sorry if I'm not speaking much right now. Peanuts doing all the talking for me here. Three to one. For a snipe hunt. No name picks up a pup, and that gives Aaron the green light to come in, but maybe a little too far too soon. He gets caught in 4K, and G Man 8181 makes this a one cap game. You can see Pink Prison looking for a kiss. Don't get it. Pink Prisoner. Everyone's scoring in this game. And that's what we like to see. It's a hell of a party. Isn't it, folks? It's always a sign of a great party when everyone comes in to score. Aaron with a lead from Nameless. Nameless dies, so G Man's now the one with a bit of an advantage here. He's got to move, though. Peanut should have this. G Man's going to take a lap, going to go around the horn a little bit, and he gets caught between a rock and a hard place. Three seventeen left to go. Almost time for our anti penultimate pups of game two half one, and we should see a lot of action on that left side. On, on a map like Yardie, never mind that. Peanut makes it five to two. No action on that left side because Ping Prisoner is the only one there. Free tag pro here to snipe hunt. Let's see how they use it. G Man with the tag. Oh no. Oh no. I could see that coming a mile away. He gets his fourth cap and he's back in form. Could this be five? Oh, double flaccid. Not what you want to see. Not what you want to see. So come up now to our penultimate pups of game two. Half one. And here comes no name with that penultimate JJ. One of them at least. Going to try and come in. Can't do it. One thirteen left to go here. Is it? I can't even tell. Did they switch teams on me? Mm, you're right. You're right. Thank you, Big Swingin'. Thank you, Big Swingin'. Yalpa is a potato. Yalpa is a potato. Let's fix that now. To come up with 45 seconds left to go in this half. How does that look now? Has that refreshed? 
I know, right? I, I, I know. I believe, uh, I believe we had Dodds Fall, who is streaming the Knights Who Said Re versus Paparazzi. I'm sorry. And we're going to do a live look in on Dodds Fall because why not create drama at this point? We're going to do a live looking on Dodds Fall and uh, see what's going on there. Peanuts trying to make this eight. Can't do it. This half in 72. Four snipe hunt over the Toronto Captors. <laughs> I'm going to apologize. It's going to look ugly for a moment. Let's do those live look-ins while I fix things on the back end. Let's check in with Dodd's Fall. All right, I'm going to be perfectly honest. I have no idea what the score is here. I think they've just started game two, half one. I can't tell. I honestly do not know. But yeah, you could check that out on twitch.tv slash bowling dash hound. That's Dodd's Fall stream. Feel free to check him out. But we're also going to check in on I Love HDTV. It looks like they've just finished, actually. Wonder how that went. Oh. Oh. Oh my. This is awkward. Echo! Go! 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 Is it coming through? Is it coming through? I can't believe you've done this, I love HD. I can't believe you've done this. Thanks for the raid. Oh no. Okay. This Three, is gonna be awkward. Two, one. But we're gonna go in the game to have to on Jardine. Looks like the group has glitched. So I'm gonna do what I can to make this pretty for you. One sec. I blame I love HD for this. Really, I do. Snipe hunts are up. Snipe hunt is up seven to two right now. That's the team in blue. I 
I can't believe you've broken my scoreboard like this, HD. But you know, sometimes here on Tag Breath of Dark, we've got to roll with the punches. Agency rolling with that RB right now. Group's so broken, a cap has occurred. From Agency. And the Toronto Captors make it 7 to 3. Yeah, Defenders can cap. It's a free it's a free planet, at least for the next three weeks. I mean, after World War III, we won't have much of anything to go on, so... I honestly could not tell you how much time is left, so we're just going to have to deal with it. My apologies, folks. Tag Pro broke. Report HD. That's right, report them. Anyway, we're just going to keep this in mind, not knowing how much time is left. Yawn is out. Pass four. This should be a cap. And it is for the Toronto Captors. And it's seven to four. The tactic out by Agency P, not on the attack air and on the continuation here for Snipe Hunt. Trying to maintain their lead. Pups are up. Hey, Aaron has no place to go. Peanut, smooth moves, walks it in. Too easy. Want to talk about basic bitch tag pro? Caps like that are what I'm talking about. Just walking it in like cinnamon. My favorite stripper. <laughs> Hope she's doing well in Canada. Anyway, agency here. 3v2. Ooh, Nameless gets by the wall. Pink Prisoner is the one to take him out. I don't believe that. I believe there's a lot more time than 113 left to go. We got a... We have Pup action here. Aaron's RB defused. No names. Left RB is taken. Chance. A what? Ooh, don't get weird on me. No name. Should make it... Five to eight, and the comeback is on. Just do a quick check right here. We've had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten pups go. As G Man puts it in, the Toronto Captors' comeback remains on. Six to eight on aggregate. I believe we are at the pre anti penultimate pup mark. The pups before the pups before the pups before the final round of pups, meaning we're a little under four minutes left if my count is correct, because that is pup 12 out of 18 taken. Aaron just nowhere to go, no name, staying alive here. Trying to give enough time for his team to have an opportunity. Nameless. Could this be the dagger? Possibly, because it's now 9 to 6 for Snipe Hunt. A 
agency is out past four here off the handy. And he refuses to let this Toronto Captors team fall to the wayside. So we're now up for the anti-penultimate pups, the pups before the pups before the final round of pups. Meaning we're a little under three minutes left to go. And Sniper gets a much needed tag, uh, tag pro. Pup sweep here. Excuse me. But can the tag pro effect change in this society? Aaron seems to think so. And Peanut now dancing, knowing this is well in hand. The penultimate pups are due momentarily. Three cap lead. All you gotta do is maintain control. And now it's Aaron's obligation, Aaron's duty to maintain that booty. And that penultimate pup, right pup is a tag for the no name. That penultimate left pup brought to you by I Love HD. Because I love HD, broke my group. It's a tag pro. The peanut. We got double tag pro leads, dueling tag pro leads here, but this all this is doing is killing time, which is not what you want if you're a fan of the Toronto Captors. And if you're a fan of the Toronto Captors, one, Drake, Jimmy, get back in the fucking wheelchair. But two, you've already gotten three points tonight. I know you want more. You'd like to make this a more productive, fruitful night. So don't give up. I believe we're about a minute 20 left to go here. No name. Puts one in. And it's still just a two-cap game here for the Toronto Captors. We were coming up on one minute left here. About 54 seconds left if my math is correct. RB to nameless. Left pup should be up now-ish. It's a JJ to no name. But that RB might be enough for Nameless and company from Snipe Hunt to hold on and get three much-needed points as they try to climb out of the cellar. And really, you've got to really secure your, 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 your cellar. Like, it's that time of year, folks. I don't know where I'm going with that. I don't like where I'm going with that. Just make sure you always have a safe word. G-Man. Trying to stay alive, trying to earn an opportunity for another cap here. Might have it. Has does not have the corner. Two, one. And the final score here is ten to eight. Valiant comeback here from the from the Toronto Captors, but it's just not enough in the end. <laughs> That's going to be it for tonight. That's a split between Snipe Hunts and Toronto Captors. But don't go anywhere, because we're going to raid somebody. Actually, no, I've got to play a game of chess. There's nobody to raid, actually. Uh, yeah, there's nobody to raid. Doubling Dash Hound is not online, as far as I can tell, unless he's blocked me. But I've got to play a game of chess. against Nippopotamus. And I'll tell you what's on the line in case this is your first time tuning in. You beat me in chess, that's 25,000 bacon bits off the hot tub reward. You beat me in GeoGuessr, that's 50,000. You beat me in Trivia, that's 100,000 big ones. And right now, Nippopotamus and the Weed People team have been working hard and they've been making me look quite foolish in chess. And they've gotten that 250,000 incentive down to 200,000. Yes, yes, yes. You gotta do it in the, you've gotta, you've gotta redeem your bacon bits to get a challenge in. Tell Wayne to get 2,000 bacon bits and challenge me. Cause I'm down, I'm ready for it. I've been dueling, I've been bad at it. 
that I've been dueling. And I'm, I'm ready for his challenge. want to do this at five minutes with three second increments but right now i'm going to get my ass kicked in chess you've gotta you've gotta put in the increment put in the uh reward with the with your bacon bits two thousand bacon bits challenge and yeah winner gets the spoils i'm just setting up right now yeah in this. Okay. And that. In here. Alright, Nippopotamus, are you ready? Is he in here? I am. He is in here. Alright, five minutes, three seconds. Okay. Oh. And that challenge should be going out to you, Nippopotamus. Right here, right now. There we go. All right, time to get my ass kicked. Ah, uh, seems reasonable. Why do I always forget how to... How to play? Yeah. I forget that too. I forget how to play. Hey, Funky Spud. Konban wa o genki desu ka? Oh, gods. I left E Trade months ago. By the way, if you have not yet, check out Funky Spice. He's the music you hear at the beginning of each stream. And at before each half. And after each half. Not at the end of the stream though, that's from someone in Greenland. Be sure to check out his Twitch channel, twitch.tv slash funky spud. He gets his spuds on. Sure does. I feel like I should have probably defended something. Oh, well. maybe. I don't know. I've forgotten how to play. Actually, yeah.
I do not like your knight, sir. Fine. I'll move it. Fine. What? Oh, yep. shit. Yep. I realized like four moves ago I fucked up royally, and I'm not even going to look at it on stream, but I did it, and it's done, and now that 200k is down to 175k. I forgot my bishop was covering that. I thought it was yeah. just a check. Nice. Yeah, as soon as I, as soon, like, early on, I made a mistake with my pawn structure, and... I overextended with my knights, and there was nothing I could do to get back from that. Yeah, you allowed the the one attack, the whole knight bishop thing. Yeah. Early oh. on there. All right, I don't even have anyone to uh, raid right now. Ooh. So I'm just gonna have to end the stream, aren't I? So yeah, thanks for sticking around. Uh, we're down to 175,000 baking bits for the hot tub. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time. I'm feeling better, by the way. So, I may be back on the bike tomorrow. Hopefully. Hopefully. Dr. Gates, please call me. Seriously. It's been a week. So, yeah. Until then. Bye! Peace out. What's up, YouTube? Stop being weird.